this match, just going back to the match, um, super duper fun match, all these table bumps happening here and there, some pretty dangerous stuff. Jamal did a top rope splash from the top to the outside for a table, I believe, yeah. on Jeff. On just looks Jeff. like he absolutely crushed him. Crushed him, yeah. <laughs> it was it was crazy. I've got to say, tabling yourself and it not counting for an elimination match does seem like a wishy-washy rule. They seem to change the rules on this every now and then. Mm. I feel like I've seen tables matches where going through yourself does count, and then yes. later they would decide, oh, no, it doesn't count. So, <laughs> What do you think? I think it should count. If it's an I think elimination it should- match... Yeah, I, absolutely. I think it should count. This is, it's, I, I feel like the first ever tables match was from your favorite pay-per-view ever, Royal Rumble 2000, I believe, was it? Jeff, uh, uh, Hardys and Dudleys. Hardys and Dudleys. And I remember watching that at the time and just being like, what is this? My mind was like completely blown at the time. Are you a fan of table matches? 100%, yeah. I feel I, um... like... I, can, I, it's, I don't know why it's I don't know if it's the sound of it breaking or something but there's something so addictive to it and it never gets boring I feel like yeah. it is kind of boring now the table I don't. Bumps. well I mean ask me in what 50 episodes time. <laughs> <laughs> but I still like it I really do it's my favorite I'm not gonna say it's my favorite kind of like gimmick or, or ma- no I, I am gonna say that I do I just like pure tables match Better than TLC or or a ladder match or something. I don't know. Really? I just yeah, it's very. Um, if you if you get tabled, you're eliminated. It's just a very kind of clean rule, mm. uh, which is why I'm so annoyed about the whole tabling yourself well, doesn't count. Whereas the ladder match, it's sometimes you have to get a you have to get an item, and there's just like other things. But I feel like a tables match just being hey, if you go through that thing, it's game over. You raise a good point. There. It's excellent. You raise a good point because. So there's a TLC match, right? Which stands for tables, ladders, and chairs. But the tables and and chairs part don't actually play into the rules. To the rules, yeah. You can can go through those as many times as you want. But a normal ladder match is no disqualification as well. So in a ladder match, you can go through tables Tables. and you can use chairs. So realistically, is there any difference between a TLC match and a ladder match? No. There isn't. There isn't, is there? From a rules perspective, no. What if they did a TLC match where there was belts at the top, which so you climb ladder to get that, but you could also lose the match by going through tables. And I guess you'd have to implement the chair as well, which I don't know how you would do. <laughs> if you get hit in the head with a chair, then you lose. <laughs> well, you lose the game of life we well, yeah. nowadays. Yeah. Um, <laughs> No, or yeah, or um, they're the only sanctioned foreign objects. Okay, so if yeah. you get out a stop sign, you you know there are there are certain rules, perhaps. But then in a ladder um, match, it should be the ladder is the only weapon to, allowed to be used. But it's not, yeah. So it's it's it, it's it's interesting. Yeah, it is. Um, or you can only eliminate someone by putting them on a table and then jumping off the ladder. But then that would just favour certain types of performers. So. Yeah, we're going to have to come up with the ultimate rule. 